if you don't know who Pancho, aka Francisco Diego Witt is, well, he is a commentary YouTuber with over 1 million subscribers. And back on January 11th, he uploaded a video titled Quitting Calm Deleted. But it was then later changed into Quitting Commentary Videos. And in that video, Pancho explains how he's not the type of guy to just criticize things for the rest of his life. Hola, como estas? What's going on, people? Uh, I honestly don't even know what to say, bro. Uh, I guess I'll start this video off by saying uh, I'm going to be quitting commentary soon just because I've completely grown out of it. Uh, I've been grown out of it for a while, honestly. Like, uh, I just don't like yapping about shit too often anymore. And honestly, I don't know what type of content I'm going to make in the future. But uh, we'll figure that out when it happens. But uh, I'd say uh, I'll give it another five months until I give up the commentaries completely. Well, you could at least focus on your music career. I mean, didn't you start that like last year or the year before that? Uh, I don't know. I mean... We've just, I've just done so much already on the channel. I've talked about so much stuff. Like I, I'm just losing motivation to make those types of videos. Um, which means you won't be hearing from me as much. Um, I mean, if you do want to keep in touch with me or like hear from me or see what I'm doing, uh, go follow my Instagram because I'm gonna be a lot more real on there. I post whatever the hell I want. A lot of the time, just like no filter, just like raw thoughts. It's a clusterfuck. Go follow. Um, and yeah, I mean, six months is where I'll, I'll put it uh, for the commentary videos. Six months is quite ex insane to finish off your commentary career. But I do hope you find some success by that time. You reached that limit. Uh, forgive me if I... I'm like low energy, but I just woke up and I just wanted to get these thoughts off fresh off the dome before I even have to second think it or second guess it. Um, this, this is genuinely how I feel, bro. Like, it, the commentaries were fun while they lasted, but bro, I'm getting older. I can't just yap about shit forever. Like, that just eventually gets corny. I mean, it is understandable. And you gotta admit, it is corny that you had to make videos about transgender people and, you know, saying woke. Or at least titling the video as such because you still refuse to learn the normal definition of the word. That's a cringy, weird way to go all about this. And, uh, I'm not the type of guy to just criticize things for the rest of my life, you know? I don't want to be known as that. I got bigger goals than that. And, you know, for those who want to uh, pay attention to that, my bigger goal than just follow my Instagram. I've been doing music a lot of the time recently, uh, hence the big ass microphone. <laughs> but yeah, we'll see where the channel goes. It's definitely a little different than usual. I've always known it to just be commentary, talking to a mic type deal for any time I make videos. But, um, uh, now things are switching up. I mean, why not immediately put music videos of your own on your channel in the first place? Why not start there? I mean, you did start your music career, right? And then he goes on to thank his supporters for 1.9 million subscribers, but uh, I could care less about that right now because the main point of that video is that he's grown out of it completely. He doesn't like to yap about shit as often. He loses motivation from making these types of videos and he thinks that talking about online situations is corny so that's why he doesn't want to be known as the type of guy that just criticizes things 
and I fully understand nobody wants to be a commentary YouTuber forever. But I'm just finally glad that he's actually going to pursue another different type of career path for once. And I'm also happy for Pancho. Because back in the day, I used to watch a lot of his videos, preferably around 2021. Pancho's old content around that time was actually good, but as 2023 came around, it started to get really worse. And for this year in 2024, I'm expecting the worst. Because the current direction that Pancho started to take last year is going to be the downfall of uh, his commentary career, in my opinion. And I say this because I literally made a video on Poncho not too long ago when he uh, lacked some of knowledge of who owns NBC or who owns ABC. That's one of the main important things that rubbed me off the wrong way with Poncho. And I made a video on him for that. The bottom line here is that at the end of the day, I hope that Francisco Diego Witt succeeds in the next five to six months. And I genuinely hope that his music career is going to be better than his commentary career. And I wish him the fucking best of luck.